start out there. there. This is Robin Campbell with Deer Country. We've got two modems here, the current options on the market. We're gonna explain the differences between them and how you might use them. So here we have a modem M, and this is a modem R. We'll start with a modem R. That's a direct replacement for your three, 2G, 3G, or 4G. It's gonna have the same connections if you have a 2D or 3G antenna to hook up, same power connection and ethernet. If you are creating a new system or starting from scratch, you are gonna to need to get an antenna and you have multiple options there to get a 3G or a 4G high gain antenna. We're gonna have an HSA2 ethernet connector. Same connector on the back of a 4640 or a Gen 5. If you have a 2630 and you're replacing a 2G or a 3G, you're gonna need an adapter and our power connector. That's a direct replacement for a 2G, 3G, or 4G, that's just gonna be a drop-in. Same hardware as a 4G, so you don't need to replace it if you have one. If you're trying to build a system, you're gonna need a power connector to hook to that. Our newer option is a modem M. This comes with a power cable. I have one plugged in here to a Gen 5 display, but to explain what's on it, this comes with a power connector. You have to plug into your tractor and it has a service port that you can get onto the tractor CAN bus and get codes and information from the tractor. So this is a great option for something like a 30 series tractor, say like a 7430. This is everything you need to get this connected to the op center. Now, if you do need to connect it to a display, it includes a new two wire ethernet cord that's found on the back of a Gen 5, but you'll not find this on the back of a 2630 or a Gen 4. So if you are gonna use this and connect to one of them, you're gonna need an ethernet switch, which is gonna require another power cord and a Y in there. So you only need one convenience outlet on the tractor, but you are gonna need some other components. But if you are trying to connect this to a new Gen 5 screen, you're gonna have everything you need that comes with this modem M. It includes the power harness and this ethernet cable. You're gonna have everything you need to get a Gen 5 connected to the opposite. Now the differences in why you might use one of these, if you already have a 2G, 3G, or 4G that needs replaced in a tractor, put this in. Or let's say you have maybe a 6R that didn't have JD Link and you wanna go for more of the factory option, that's gonna be a great fit there. It's also gonna be the modem you need if you wanna do machine sync because this has Wi-Fi antenna capabilities. Now the modem M, if you have a Gen 5, it's the perfect fit. It's gonna work the best. It's gonna come with all the cables you need. It's very economical. Or if you just wanna have the connection on say like a skid loader, an older tractor that uh, 30 series or newer, 70 series or newer combine that you wanna to connect to the op center or even just track a piece of equipment with just 12 volts, this will send in the location of the equipment. We can use maintenance manager, geofencing and curfew. If we can connect it to a piece of equipment through service advisor, depending on the equipment, you're gonna get information like hours, codes, fuel level, diagnostic capabilities with that. So if you have any further questions, just give us a ring here at Deer Country or Connected Support Department, we'd be happy to help you. Thanks.